Imagine living in a world where you couldn't use Google, launch a rocket, or even use a calculator. That was humanity before one small circle changed everything. It begins with nothing, a void. And now we take it for granted, the number zero, a symbol so ordinary that it hides its own miracle. But there was a time when humanity had no concept of nothing, no zero, no placeholder, no true mathematics. While other civilizations counted with symbols carved in stone, it was ancient India that dared to imagine the void and give it meaning. In the fifth century, Indian scholars didn't just treat zero as emptiness, they gave it existence. Shunya, they called it, the void, the nothing, yet also the infinite potential from which all things emerge. From the temple schools of India, Aryabhata wrote numbers in place value form, the first to represent the vastness of the cosmos with mathematical precision. He measured the motion of planets, calculated Earth's rotation, and hinted at infinity long before modern science could imagine it. His work became the seed from which the Indian mathematical tradition blossomed, a civilization that saw no boundary between science and spirituality. Then came Brahmagupta, who took the next step, formalizing the concept of zero as a number in his 7th century masterpiece, the Brahmasfuta Siddhanta. He defined its laws, how zero behaves when added, subtracted, or multiplied. In his hands, zero was no longer an empty placeholder. It was a number that turned something into nothing, and nothing into infinity. This was more than arithmetic. It was philosophy, a reflection of India's deepest thought, that emptiness is not absence, but origin, that from nothing, creation itself begins. Centuries later, the idea traveled through scholars and traders to the Islamic world, then to Europe. There, the Italian mathematician Fibonacci learned the Indian numerals through Arabic texts. The zero of India became the cipher of the West, and soon all of modern mathematics was reborn. Without zero, there is no algebra, no calculus, no physics, no digital world. Every rocket launched, every computer coded, every equation written, carries within it that ancient Indian circle of nothingness. It's poetic. The symbol of nothing became the foundation of everything. A circle drawn by Indian minds over 1,500 years ago now powers the engines of modern civilization. In the end, zero is not just a number. It is a philosophy that creation begins when the void is understood. From Shunya to infinity, the journey of nothing that made us everything.